Joe Rogan here. Welcome to Elon Town, place where you'll want to stay. You'll meet Alex Jones with his rotten plan. Joe Rogan will save the day. Elon Musk is new in town. Soon he and Ziggy are friends. With pixels, Stingy, and Trixie too. They're gonna have a blast together. Go, 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 get up Elon Town. It's the start of a brand new day. Things are upside down here in Elon Town. Adventure's just a moment away. I'd like to welcome you all to my new town here just outside Austin, Texas. And now it's time to make a cake. Hey, uh, Elon, why are we making a cake anyway? Uh, it doesn't make sense. I pile on the can. It's such a pretty sight. It makes the food taste dandy, but my tummy hurts all night. I'll put in some ingredients and keep the rest for me. Good job. I'm not just disobedient. I'm careful, can't you see? It's a piece of cake to make a pretty cake. What? If the way is hazy, you better do the cooking by the book. What? You know you can't be lazy. Never use a messy recipe. Okay. The cake will end up crazy. If you do the cooking by the book. What? Then you'll have a cake. We gotta have it made. You know that I love cake. Finally, it's time to make a cake. Greg Abbott here. Making food is just like science, with tools that blend and baste. And every fun appliance gives the food a different taste. It's a piece of cake, you pick a pretty cake. If the way is hazy, you gotta do the cooking by the book. You know you can't be lazy, never use a messy recipe. The cake will end up crazy if you do the cooking by the book. Then we'll have a cake. We gotta have it made. You know that I love cake. Finally, it's time to make a cake. Gotta have it made. You know that I love cake. Finally, it's time to make a cake. You gotta Tesla. do the cooking by the book. That's a pretty big cake you got there, Elon. I'd be careful. This is Jake Tapper, and I have with me James Comer, a chairman of several House committees, is demanding that Prosecutor Alvin Bragg uh, present himself to Congress to explain why he is indicting a past president in a, quote, uh, political prosecution. Uh, James, uh, can you tell us... Uh, what is it that you're doing? Yes, Jake, uh, Mr. Bragg has asked us to stay out of local investigations. Uh, the only problem is the investigation that he's doing is obviously a federal investigation, and he should stay out of that. I will stay out of local investigations as long as he does tit for tat and stays out of the federal investigations of, of a crime that Donald Trump has not committed. A former president and presidential candidate, I might add. Mr. Comer, I'll have to stop you right there. It appears that uh, some breaking news has just taken place and uh, Donald Trump has been indicted by a grand jury in Manhattan. Well, I'll be tired and feathered, it's already happened. The question now is whether Trump's followers will follow through with the violence that Trump has called for again and again. As he came into the window with the sound of a crescendo, came into the apartment, he left the blood stains on the carpet. He ran under the table, he could see he was unable. So she ran into the bedroom, he was struck down, it was his doom. Alvin, are you okay? Alvin, are you okay? Are you okay, Alvin? Alvin, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, Alvin? Alvin, are you okay? So Alvin, are you okay? Are you okay, Alvin? Alvin, are you okay? Alvin, are you okay? Are you okay, Alvin? Alvin, are you okay? Will you tell us that you're okay? There's a sign in the window that he struck you, a crescendo, Alvin. Came to your apartment, left the blood stains on the carpet. Then you ran into the bedroom, you were struck down, it was your doom. Alvin, are you okay? So, Alvin, are you okay? Are you okay, Alvin? Alvin, are you okay? Alvin, are you okay? Are you okay, Alvin? Say, Alvin, are you okay? So, Alvin, are you okay? Are you okay, Alvin? You've been hit by, you've been struck by, smooth criminal. I don't understand why any of this would be my fault. Not like I told anybody to send him any powder 
or make some death threats. So they came here to the outway. It was Sunday. What a black day. I'll brag here. Mouth of resuscitation. Sounding heartbeats. Intimidations. Annie, are you okay? Say, Annie, are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? Annie, are you okay? So, Annie, are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? Annie, are you okay? So, Annie, are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? Annie, are you okay? So, Annie, are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? Say, Annie, are you okay? Will you tell us that you're okay? There's a sign in the window that he struck you, a crescendo, Annie. He came into your apartment, left the blood stains on the carpet. Then you ran into the bedroom, you were struck down, it was your doom. Annie, are you okay? So, Annie, are you okay? Are you okay? And you've been hit by, you've been struck by, smooth criminal. I will be uh, prosecuting Donald Trump as uh, to the full extent of the law, and uh, there's nothing that will stop me. Threats won't stop me, violence won't stop me, nothing okay. will stop me. I want everybody to clear the area right now! Lauren Bulbert here, and the witch hunt by the woke left has continuing as they have, are indicting and condemning the people's president. We will not sit still for this. We will not stand for this. Donald, are you okay? Will you tell us that you're okay? I'm pretty good. There's a sign in the window that he struck you. A crescendo, Donald. I don't think he so. Came your apartment, left the blood stain on the carpet. Nobody can take me down. Into the bedroom, you were struck down. It was your doom, Donald. Donald, are you okay? Will you tell us that you're okay? I'm okay. There's a sign in the window that he struck you. A crescendo, Donald. Donald will never get me. Your apartment. Left the blood stains on the carpet. There's blood stains. Then you ran into the bedroom. You were struck down. It was your well, doom. Well, Annie, kill me. I mean, Donald. Thanks for your support. I appreciate it. I will not be brought down by this indictment. The people's president will go on. We'll make America great again and again. Naga -ga. Congress will do everything in its power to review this action by an unauthorized local DA. And I'm telling you, Jake, you have not heard the last of this committee. I guarantee it. This has been The Lead with Jake Tapper signing off. Our coverage continues with the Situation Room right next door with Wolf Blitzer. At Marjorie Taylor Greene here, and I'm in uh, downtown New York uh, just supporting my president, Donald Trump who is being treated very unfairly by Alvin Bragg of the Manhattan DA. You tell them, Marjorie. They can't push us around. Start spreading the news. I'm leaving today. I want to be no part of it. New York, New York. These high-heeled shoes are long and to stray. Did you see me on 60 Minutes? Right through the very heart of it. New York, New York. I want to wake up in a city that doesn't sleep and find I'm king of the hill top of the heap melting away I'll make a brand new start of it in old New York if I can make it there I'll make it anywhere it's up to you New York New York that's how I feel, and I wish these Democrats would stop blowing those bloody whistles. Thank you, Marjorie. New York, New York. You're welcome, Mr. President. I want to wake up in a city that never sleeps. I've been in New York a long time and never sleeps. And five time number one, top of the list. King of the hill, top of the hill. Sing it, Marjorie. These little town blues. 
I saw you on 60 Minutes. They were very unfair to you. Are melting away. I'm gonna make a brand new start of it. In old New York And If I can make it there I'm gonna make it Anywhere Even in Congress It's up to you New York New That's right, Marjorie, New York. It's my hometown. It's where I've been arrested. Oh, well, can't win them all. It's very sad. Very sad indeed. Welcome to Elon Town. Mike Pence here, and it seems that I will have to testify to Special Counsel Jack Smith as I've been subpoenaed, so I don't have a choice. That's right, Mike. Jack Smith here. Sorry, Mr. Trump. That's how it is. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. You made a mistake. Uh oh. Uh oh. Tell me things that can't be true. Your slacks are on fire. I'm fanning the flames. Like a vampire stood out in broad day. Should have been wiser while picking out what you were gonna say. Oh. Fool me once, that's once too many Better luck next time you've met me Where's the dunce who caught you meddling? Turn around Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh You made a mistake Uh oh, uh oh Tell me things that can't be true You're sweating this time, I'm reading your eyes being called out cause you slipped your mouth your face is turned pale gonna think you're not well while you were distracted i cast a spell <laughs> you can't use mike pence he can't testify uh oh you better run away now right now uh oh you've made a mistake uh, right now you oh got nothing else to say to you uh oh Mr. Trump, you can't intimidate Mike Pence into not testifying. Isn't that right, Mike? Well, I uh, I don't see as I have a choice. I mean, I have been subpoenaed. Don't do it, Mike! Or give this win into mission. Where's your loyalty? Tragically, I'm not the victim here. If only I fell for your fiction. I'll sue you, Mike! Tell me things that can't be true. I wouldn't do it, Mike! Mike Pence will testify, Mr. Trump. That's right. What what he said. Sean Hannity here with uh, Lindsey Graham. Um, Lindsey, how do you feel about this prosecution? And I, I'm just completely broken up over this Donald Trump getting indicted thing. And, and I think that if you've got any money, you should probably be sending it to me or to him or to someone. Otherwise, we're in the worst trouble this is selective prosecution. Uh, they wouldn't have prosecuted him if it was Sleepy Joe's son. Do you like my new tan and my, my hair? Uh, I think it looks great. What do you think? I think it looks fine, Lindsay. Uh, very stylish. Got Marjorie Taylor Greene here who's going to sing us a little song. Go ahead, Marjorie. I I'll try not to cry too much. Thank you, Lindsay. Uh, uh, Donald Trump is being joined by some of the most incredible people in history who have been arrested by the government. Uh, Nelson Mandela, he was arrested and uh, served time. And Jesus Christ, he was arrested and, and, and murdered. Uh, let me sing a little song. Uh, this is just for uh, Mr. Trump. Oh, it must have been cold there in my shadow. Never have sunlight on your face You were content to let me shine 
that's your way You always walk the step behind Thanks for the song, Marjorie! So I was the one with all the glory While you were the one with all the strength A beautiful face without a name For so long A beautiful smile to hide the pain I do have a beautiful smile, ask anybody! Did you ever know that you're my hero? I mean that, Mr. Trump. Yeah, I knew it! Everything I would like to be. I knew all about it, Marjorie! I can fly higher than an eagle. After all, I inspire millions! You are the wind beneath my wings. Perhaps even billions! Wow, well, beautiful Marjorie, I'll take the next verse. It might have appeared to go unnoticed. But I've got it all here in my heart. You have a heart, Lindsay? I had no idea. I want you to know I know the truth. You know the truth? Uh oh. Of course I know it. I would be nothing without you. Oh, that truth. Yeah, that's true, all right. Did you ever know that you're my hero? Every day, let's see, every day. You're everything I wish I could be. I like the hair. I like the tan. You're getting there. You're looking good. I could fly higher than an eagle. Let's not get carried away there, Lindsay. For you are the wind beneath my way. Thanks, Lindsay. Did I ever tell you you're my hero? You're my hero too, Lindsay. You're everything, everything I wish I could be. Oh, and I, I could fly higher than I I don't need to fly like an eagle, I have a private jet! You are the wind beneath my wing. You guys don't need to worry, I won't go to jail! Oh, you are the wind beneath my wing. The Trump never goes to jail, ask anybody! Oh, the wind beneath my wings. You, 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 you are the wind beneath my wings. Fly. I'm flying. Fly. I said I'm flying. Fly away. Okay. You let me fly so high. Thank you. Ooh, you the wind beneath my wings. Oh, you, 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 the wind beneath my wings. I'm like a hurricane! Fly. Blowing under you! Fly. Blowing under your wings! So high against the sky! I think I'm gonna cry too, Mr. Trump. I, I wanna thank you for everything you've done for me. And I came down to New York to show my support, and, and so did uh, George Santos. Yeah, I did, though. Nobody seemed to notice. I don't know. Get lost, George. You're the wind beneath my wings, Mr. President. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Lindsay, what have you done to your hair? You look like an idiot. This is Sean Hannity saying good night. Marvin, this is Clarence. I don't know how we're going to get out of this. It seems like they know everything about us. What are we going to do? Clarence, uh, you have to calm down. I think that's the first thing. Listen, you don't understand, Harley. They see me rolling, play hating, patrolling. They trying to catch me riding dirty. 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 My music's so loud, I'm swinging. 
I hope I'm not dead, gonna catch me riding dirty. Try to catch me riding dirty. You try to catch me riding dirty. You try to catch me riding dirty. Try to catch me riding dirty. CNN's trying to make me lean, but I think I'm just clean. Jenny is the January 16, and I've ruined the court and the TV screen. Get a new house for my mom, she's like, hold up. Next is a vacation in the Caribbean, a private jet and a limousine. Girl, you ain't no, I'm crazy like Kavanaugh. Just trying to bone and trying to break no laws. Throw it Roe v. Wade in seconds. MSNBC, you know they hate me. Morning Joe insults to the maximum. I can speak for some justices trying to get some. But we got Perry and Chardonnay and Caviar Yum. Security got those protesters out of here now. Just because they want control over their bodies, but we won't give them that. Legal precedent means nothing. Next is the morning after pill. And then we'll take away all of your rights. Use that and we'll issue warrants in Houston and all the red states. They see me rolling. They hating, patrolling, they trying to catch me riding dirty. They're 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 trying to catch me riding dirty. My music so loud, I'm swinging. They hoping that they're gonna catch me riding dirty. They're trying to 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 catch me riding dirty. I've been drinking and smoking cigars because I just can't focus. I gotta get the home Ford Popo, Scope, Harlan's, Rolls Royce, swerving all up in the mansion curve. Jenny Ben sipping on that gosh slag and the martini jet set speeding, doing a hundred while I sniff some blow. And roll another one up, we live like me ain't giving a poop. I got a Cuban in my right hand and Don Perry on freezing my Supremes. Standing on Harlan's yacht, come pretty deep, me and my Jenny. I gotta get back to the Supreme Court. Need to strike down some more lift hard laws. Clock, clock, draws, drop as we creep, creep, pop, pop. Hope them don't see me on a low key. No regards for the law, we dodge them and like strike them down. Keep a bar in a car and we line the snore. Well, what if you want, just you pop in dark. Ready or not, we bust shots off in the air. Harlan Crow, the bajillionaire. They see me rolling, they hating. Patrolling, they trying to catch me riding dirty. 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 My music's so loud, I'm swinging. They hoping that they're gonna catch me riding dirty. Trying to 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 catch me riding dirty. You think so? I tried to let you know. The first black just and I tried to do it slow. They think they have a way to take me down. With all the trips and swag and such in the bands. So they get behind me, trying to check my tags. Look at my review and they smiling. Thinking they'll catch me on the wrong side. Well, keep trying because the damn lion is racial profiling. Use the text, you can check my tags. Help me or try to steal my swag. Got a pocket, gotta get my cash. Cause there ain't nothing like a little money can't fix. And Harlem pulls out his rich white man card and they let us go. When they realize I ain't riding dirty, bet you'll be living with an even better mood. I'ma laugh at you and I'ma laugh at the crews. I have to dinner date with Harlan's masseuse. It's a message to the laws tell them we hate you. Can't be touched or tell them that they should've known. Jet enough for another get away with Harlan. Jenny and I will be long gone for long and we'll never come back. They see me rolling, they hating. Rolling, they're trying to catch me riding dirty. Try 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 to catch me riding dirty. My music's so loud. I'm swinging. They hoping that they're gonna catch me riding dirty. Try to 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 catch me riding dirty. Ah, you don't have anything to worry about there, Clarence. You haven't done anything wrong. Listen, uh, I'm going to the Asia next week. Uh, you want to come along just for fun? All right. Welcome to Elon Town. All right, you mega supervillains. Are you going to step up to the plate like me? I've just been indicted. I'm an official mega supervillain. What about you, Matt Gates, Lauren Bulbert, Marjorie Taylor Greene? Let's hear it from you. Matt Gates here. Uh, I'm as uh, much a supervillain Trump as you are, and I'm gonna prove it. We are number one, hey! Elon Musk here, move over MAGA people. There's no villains like billionaires. We are number one, hey! Now listen closely. I'm all ears. Here's a little blessing in trickery. This is going down in history. If you wanna be a villain number one, you have to chase a superhero on the run. Hey, who let that billionaire in here? Just follow my moves, sneak around. Be careful not to make a sound. Watch out, Marjorie! Oh, don't touch that! Sorry, Elon, it's Marjorie Taylor Green here. I didn't know that that was gonna make so much noise. I haven't been in Congress that long, you know. We are number one! 
Matt Gates here, and without a doubt, I'm the number one supervillain of all of you. We are number, number one. one. <laughs> oh, look at this net that I just found. When I say go, be ready to throw. Go! Don't throw it on me. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, Marjorie. It's not like launching a rocket, is it? Now watch and learn. Here's the deal. He'll slip and slide on this banana peel. <laughs> what is wrong with you people? I don't think they're ever going to get it. They're not smart enough. They're not smartical like me. Hey. Just ask anybody. I'm the smartest that ever was. My IQ was so high, they had to climb a ladder to read it. That's right. The Trump will never be beat in this. We, we are number one. one. Hey. Well, Donald, I'm not stupid just because I don't know any big words. Number, number one. It's just that I don't have the same education that you billionaires have, having grown up in a, a very poor household. If Mr. Trump is a supervillain, then I, Michael Cohen, I must be a superhero because I'm going to take the supervillain down. I'm testifying against you, Mr. Trump. Big mistake, Michael. I'm suing you for $500 million. I know you don't have it, but I'm suing you anyway. Just ask anybody. You're in big, big trouble. Big trouble. Come back again real soon now. <laughs>